Hi, it's Adam from GIF Music, and today I am with the most enthusiastic man that I think I've ever met regarding drums. <laughs> We're joined by Jamie Fisher from Alesis. Hi. Jamie, how are you doing? I'm good, how are you? I'm great, Excellent. because we are with two incredible kits here, and we are looking at something that I don't think has been done in the industry before. Mm. We're looking at the inclusion of a VST with an electronic drum kit. Yes, that's right. So what we've got here is the inclusion of BFD, standing for? Big Fat Drums. Let's not get that confused, Big Fat Drums. Yeah. And effectively, what we're going to look at today is how important it is to have a VST alongside an electronic drum kit and what that can actually open up for you as someone that's a recording artist, someone that is you know, at home, someone playing gigs. So let's not even dilly-dally, let's go straight into BFD, because I know that it's great, but we need to show these guys how good it is, sure, <laughs> these please. people how good this is. So let's just go straight into it. Yeah, okay, I'll take a few moments to explain what it is, and then we'll have a good listen to it. Basically, uh, BFD is a VST program, so that's a collection of amazing drums, amazing cymbals with amazing mics in the best studios, with the best engineers, recorded immaculately, multiple volume levels, Everything has been taken uh, to the nth degree of, of incredible sound quality, and then it's captured, put into a computer, and you can trigger it yourself. So these two kits both come with brilliant sounds built in, and you can gig with those sounds, you can record with those sounds, you can practice with them, no problem. But if you want to make the best quality recording, then you really need a VST. And historically, these things have cost hundreds of pounds, but now Alesis can give you this for free. So absolutely free with both of these two drum kits, you get BFD player and you get an expansion pack. An expansion pack is a set of drums and cymbals uh, and you can add extra expansion packs. Each expansion pack has got several drum kits. So in essence, you get several amazing sounding drum kits ready to go for free with every one of these two uh, drum kits sold. And that's already alongside the hundreds of uh, sounds that are in the module as well. Yes, that's right. So not only are you getting this VST, which is expansively sampled, mm -hmm. you've also got your core sounds, but enough of the core sounds. That's right, sounds. there's hundreds of sounds in the drum kits already, uh, and they're great to go uh, for, for regular rehearsing and, and so on, but yeah. um, uh, you know, the, the, the VST that you get, BFD, is pretty amazing. But I want to hear this. Yes, me too. So, <laughs> so let's go into this, because right. I know how great it sounds. So you've just opened it up, yep. you've just done your BFD download, uh, you've connected the kit, it's as easy as a MIDI cable, it's already mapped, let's hear what it does. Right, I'm just going to pick one kit here, uh, we're going to go with New Modern, that's an expansion pack, and within that expansion pack we've got several kits, I'm going to start with Original Mix Complex, that means it's got the most number of mic stems, I'll show you what that means later on. That sounds massive. Yeah, absolutely. So you've got incredible sounding drums, and because this has been all pre-mapped for you for every single Alesis kit, everything is taken care of. You can do this, and this, you can do this. That's incredibly it's important splash. for feel and the way that you're really wanting to play drums. Having that, to me, yep is essential. It is. So that's just a really nice little touch that it's, you get. It just makes you feel like you're playing a real set of drums. Yeah. You've got, of course, rim shots. Um, so it's all done for you. Everything is mapped perfectly. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, that's something you want out of the box. And not only do you get these incredible sounds, and, like, we've only just heard a tiny bit of that, but that sounds massive. Mm. You know, so to combine that with the playability and the feel, you're surely on for a winner here. Absolutely. But so, as you say, this is the complex kit. So let's right. kind of go into, you know, break it down a little bit. You know, let's not get too heavy, but let's go into kind of like how you can, you know, approach this kit. All so right. let's have a look at that. Okay, so what you've got here, let's, uh, that, this is the kit. This is the kit we just played. Uh, if we go here, we can see all the individual stems. Now, if you're using a DAW, you can send each one of these to whichever track you want. Uh, you've got kick inside and kick outside, snare top, snare, uh, normal snare drum and snare top there. Uh, we've got all the different uh, ambient mics and room mics and overheads here, which you can adjust the width of as well. So you've got absolute full control of how you want to record this. Um, 
Let's have a listen to a different kit. Let's try this one. So this is within the same expansion pack. It's just a different treatment, different tuning of the kit. Okay. And let's have a look at it here. There's our kit. Right, immediately that I got from that, you probably see in my facial expression is when you're hitting that kick, I'm feeling that, mm. like that's there, yeah. that's felt. So like, that's not necessarily something that you can get from a module all the time. So when you've got something as powerful as that, mm. Not only is it a great sound, but it's also like inspires you and makes you want to play more. Yeah, but something right. that was cool on that was that little delay effect. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So on this particular kit, you've got a delay, but you can take it out if you want. So we go here, yeah, and we go to our uh, let's have a look. Where are we? Uh, effects. There we go. Yank that fader down. So it's gone. So you've got full, full uh, access to changing the sounds as you want to. And you were talking about that kick drum. It is a Pearl Masterworks kick 22 by 16. I so mean, that makes the, sense. the software actually tells you what drums and cymbals you're using. And if you've got several expansion packs installed as I have, I've got four here, uh, you can mix and match. So you can bring in different drums, different cymbals from those expansion packs, make your own kits, and then save them to be used later as well. And this is, <laughs> just to reiterate this, you get this free. Yeah. So not only do you get an incredibly sturdy, malleable piece of gear in, you know, these modules, these pads. These pads feel great mm. as well, by the way. Let's not just skim over that. They feel fantastic. But you get these massive sounds that are so hard to achieve at home that it's almost ridiculous that you get it free. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> and so should we ever listen to a different expansion pack? Yeah. Okay, so we listened to the new modern sound pack, the first one. Uh, let's have a listen to a different one. I've got four installed here. Let's try London 1970s. Yeah. I mean, so, there's a sound that comes to mind there, so let's see what this sounds like. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> well, uh, so each sound pack has got a complex mix, which is basically the one with the most mic stems. That's the starting point, uh, and then there are several different kits based around that with some more extreme sound treatments. This is the uh, original one. So we can already hear that we've got a nice, low-pitched, open snare drum there. Sounds like it's in a big room. Yeah. And we've also got a velocity switch on the ride cymbal pad. So we can crash the ride as we lean into it. Choke the cymbals, of course. Let's check the toms out. Nice, low-pitched, big, dry toms. Right, so that's our starting point for that sound pack. Let's pick another one. So inside the same sound pack, one of the songs is called When the Zeppo Breaks. Any clues as to what that might sound like? <laughs> Let's have a go. Um, right. I already know what it sounds like. That sounds, so obviously that, um, what it's referring to, um, it's quite a hard drum sound to nail, so that's not something that you really kind of have an opportunity to do without a VST like this. And it's such a classic sound, we can actually see what such the drums are. Such a classic are. sound. That's right. Ludwig drums, of course, uh, and the <laughs> bass drum is a massive 26 by 14 Vista Light bass drum. It's actually called the Vista Light Kick of Doom in here. Uh, so <laughs> so these... not only do you only have to carry around a laptop, yeah. you don't have to carry around no, a 26 inch 20, I wouldn't go in my car, it's, it's massive. <laughs> so that's what you get. You get this huge, I think we can say Bonham, can't we? We can say it. We get this huge Bonham sound. Ah, yes. Fantastic. A massive uh, Bon Johnham sound. Yeah, yes. there you go. Huge. <laughs> so yeah. that's, that's, uh, that's an example of what you get from one of the other sound packs. Uh, and there's another sound pack called Lo-Fi Funk we've got here. Let's have a listen to that. There's a bunch of different ones here. I'm just going to pick one. Uh, Funky Bruce. So this is to you, Funky Bruce. <laughs> this one's for the funk. Yeah. So I'm expecting something a bit drier here. Yeah. Definitely drier. Kind of disco-y almost. Yeah. 
something I picked up immediately then was just the open clasp for a second. Just oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. That reaction, so good. Yeah, and like I couldn't because <laughs> I've seen you play before. I can kind of see when you get in a groove. Oh yeah, and you don't get pulled away. No, you don't right. get pulled out with a clasp like that, no, it's which nice. is fantastic. That's Amazing it. response. That's, it's beautiful. And these drums are just, they're so inspiring. They sat, they're real drums recorded beautifully with, uh, with clear vision in mind. This is clearly a kind of dry 70s disco sort of sound we've got here. Let's try another one. Uh, this one is called Funky Jefferson. All right, a bit higher, a yeah. little bit more room sound. Um, perhaps uh, not so much of, of a disco sound, maybe more of a kind of pop sound. So we've obviously looked at all these different sounds, the expansion packs, but effects are important, especially if you want to be creative. So let's take a look at some of the effects sure on this. Okay, well this particular kit has got a very obvious effect. By the way, this is my favourite kit sound. This sounds huge. Great. So you've got so you've got that really cool delay, mm -hmm. which adds that expansion. But if I want to pull it back a bit, how easy is that to do? It's really easy. Let's have a look. So we've got an effects slider here. Let's have a listen with the effects up. Oh, it's there just go. gone. <laughs> there you go. So you've got adjustability of things like uh, effects as well. Yeah. So, I mean, that alone... Just just going over this kit entirely. Massive sounds, incredible playability and integration into your kit, architectural amendments that you can make, room sounds, microphones, drums, everything like that, and it's free. And it's really easy to use, it's pre-configured for you, and it's free. And it's free. <sighs> Jamie, I don't think we need to go into this anymore because, frankly, we might go into a wormhole and be here for hours. So... <laughs> Thank you so much for showing us BFD. My pleasure. Um, I've been Adam from GIF Music. If you want to find out any more about BFD and all the Elise's kits that we do, go to gifmusic.com. If you like the video, give it a like, give it a subscribe, and we'll see you very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.